Hello, today I'm going to talk about an American Standard flush valve assembly in your toilet tank. Uh, a couple of little problems you can have with them and how to correct them. Um, one thing that we have here is a beaded chain and I do like this uh, by American Standard as far as the whole setup goes. Um, the beaded chain, if there's a little a little um, slack in the chain, you will have to hold it in order to drain the tank. And another problem that they do have with this system, and it's not so much their problem, I guess it is as far as a water problem goes, down inside this cannon uh, shaped assembly, there's a small hole down at the very bottom, down here. And what will happen is the sediment from your water, I'm just trying to find that right now, looking at it backwards, the sediment from your water um, will settle down there and after you've flushed the tank, or the toilet, what happens is the, the weight of the water will hold this column like so and will not allow the mechanism to drop down. Um, it's just a matter of taking something, and this is a piece of solder but a coat hanger, and moving it around the bottom until you find that hole, clear it out. It's great if you clear this the uh, sediment out of the bottom, but if you do clear it out, flush it a few times, and actually take a, a glass of water, and or a pitcher of water, hold it up like so, pour it down the column a few times, and try and remove as much of that sediment as you can. But that is the reason why you you have to flip the valve a few, flip the handle a few times in order for the uh, tank to stop filling. Um, another problem that they do have with them, it's not that often, but the flapper when it comes down on the seat um, will sometimes get worn here. They will change shape eventually and they do have to be replaced. The ones years ago had a brass bolt through there and they thread it off. The new style that they have just has a press on as I wrestle with press on flapper. So it just pulls off and uh, just a matter of pressing it back onto place. You can do this in the tank. Another way to do it is there's a set of, I call them ears, and it's just a matter of pressing them apart, like so. That's one. There's two. Take the whole assembly out. There you have it. Out of the tank now. Replacing this. It's quite easy to put back in place. It's just a matter of sliding one back into the hole, bring the other one over, and there you have it. And that's about all the problems that you do have with these. They are a very good product. Just remember, the sediment does build up inside the, uh, the cannon, and flipping the handle is the only way to get it down, unless you clear it out. I hope that helped. Have a great day. Thanks.